What's up, Penguin Nation? My name is Kron, and we are here with a battle with Eon, also known as by another name on Facebook that I don't have open right now. So I will not be referring to his real name. We'll be calling him Eon. Um, so we he asked me for a uh, you you and under battle, but I think his team is full R U and under. So uh, props to you. I'm bringing only, uh, basically half my team is Yu Yu, so I'm just gonna like, anyways, um, I have the Choice Bandit Flygon, the Mega Ampharos, and the Citrus Berry, uh, Offensive Trevenant, um, those are my, uh, Yu Yu, and, um, Weezing is, uh, Black Sludge Weezing Defensive, um, my Eviolite Dewblade, which is also defensive, but, uh, I'm trying to use it, I meant to bring it offensively. Um, and then my special wall, Jellicent, who is RU, I believe. So, um, let us get this, oh wait, no, his team. Eh, you'll see his team later. Um, so looking at his team, though, I thought he would start with the Zoro clearly, so I thought, uh, I started with the Flagon. Um, let's just start. Um, so yeah, looking at his team, Eon is issuing a challenge, which is Yellow Eyes. Yellow Eyes Eyes. Um... I said now Karida, the uh, Garo's mom, I mean the Flygon. Um, so he starts with the Kududu, and then I have no idea what Mercury does, so I'm like, I'll just go for the U turn. He goes to the Confuse Ray, so I'm like, oh, prankster! Right! Oh my god, at least he's not swag playing me. He's a better person than the swag play, so that's good. U turn does a butt time because I am choice banded, and then I switch into. Excalibur, you can guess who that is. But you know why I'm so dumb? I was just like, he is prankster. Oh, I'll go in the shadow sneak. I'm like, wait. The second I pressed it, I was like, wait. Prankster's priority too. Oh my god. I do get the shadow sneak off, but it's not very effective. So there's like... I was That was just the dumbest play of the game. Without a doubt. So I'm like, well, since I'm in here, I might as well try and kill this thing. I mean, it is just a freaking bird. I mean... Nope! I get hit. I slap myself straight up into my face. I just take that sword and I just go BOW! Smack myself in the face. And Dark Pulse does a butt ton, even though it's just a Mercury. So I'm like, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! So Iron Head is able to take this Garsh Dark Kududu out! Freaking hell. I don't like crows. I don't like that crow. God damn it. Um... So he sends out his Gallade, um, and I'm like, well, the Shadow Sneak is coming, so I'm going to switch out into my Weezing, who uh, is named Shanghai, because uh, air pollution. That is literally what Weezing is supposed to be. Um, so he goes to the Shadow Sneak, that does little to nothing, and then with the Black Sludge, that did basically nothing. Um, so he goes to the Psycho Cut here, I thought he would do that, but uh, I know I'm going to live because I am defensive, and I go for the Willow, so basically this Gallade is useless. Um, now he's burned, I get my black sludge, and then he's gonna get burn hurt. So, lots of in-between stuff again. And, uh, he's gonna go for the psycho cut again. Um, maybe hoping that he'll get a crit, because psycho cut does have a high crit ratio, but he doesn't, and I get the pain split off, and look at how little, like, what the heck? Like, does Galley just have, like, no H, no, like, that was like nothing. Goes to the Drain Punch, not sure if that was a misclick, or a um, predicted switch, or an honest attempt to get uh, damage or HP back. I don't know, but I go for the Toxic Spikes, hoping, eh, I'll poison whatever comes in next. But no! Because I forgot he has Roserade. But because I did that, I predicted that he would switch right into Roserade here. So that's why I took this chance to switch out of my Weezing, even though I probably should have just gone for like a Sludge Bomb because I do have it. Um, I didn't. I switched into my Ampharos, Mega Ampharos, Pegasus. But then I realized I don't know what Roserade does, so I'm like maybe he'll switch out. I don't. Maybe I don't know. So I'll just I'll just Cotton Guard, I guess. I don't know. Um, I think I should really get rid of Cotton Guard, honestly, I should get uh, Agility, might be better, because this is modest. But wow, he has Dazzling Gleam! I'm like, I, uh, Roserade, you, what? 
and then you go for the sludge bomb this time. That's basically how as much as uh as much as uh Dazzling Gleam did. I go for the Dragon Wolves, and I think this thing is assault vested, cause wow, that's a nothing. This thing's mega Ampharos, man. I go into the Hollow Ichigo because um I'm guessing it's he goes to the uh, he goes to the Giga Drain. I don't know if that was again a predicted switch or a misclick, but uh, he does go for it and he heals up a lot. He has a Shadow Ball too. I'm like, what the heck, Roserade? Are you kidding me? That is, it's crazy. I eat my citrus and then I set up the sub because I didn't think that that would do that much. I guess I'm used to using a specially defensive one because that was a lot of damage. I eat my citrus again twice in one turn, but that is just alluding to the fact that I won't ever get a citrus ever again, ever. <coughs> Excuse me. So he goes to the Shadow Ball here, clearly destroying my sub, like literally obliterating it out of our universe. Um, and I go for the Shadow Claw, hoping for a crit. I am offensive, but no, doesn't kill. He gets the poison, so I'm just like, everything is going wrong right now. Literally everything is going wrong. So he can take me out with a Shadow Ball here. But he goes to the Giga Dream. That was a misclick. He confirmed that. That was not a predicted switch. I was so excited when that happened. Because I was like, he predicted the switch! He predicted the switch! Ah! But no, no. He just, he just, he just misclicked. So that might have cost him the game because, um... Well, I guess I could have switched into something else. And then, uh, taken it out relatively quickly. But here he sets out his Mega Beebs. Bidoof! Ah! Oh, Mega Bidoof! Ah! Oh. But he goes to him Amnesia here, and I was like, that was a mistake! That was a great mistake, because I have the Wood Hammer, not the Horn Leech, because I am offensive, the Wood Hammer, and that is gonna kill this thing in one hit, and that is why I think that misclick mattered so much. Because if he had taken out Hollow Ichigo before, I'd been able to take out his, um, Mega Bidoof! Mega Bidoof! Oh, he probably wouldn't be able to I don't know. Do more things. So, um... Bring that a Zoroark now. Unconventionally. Because, uh, Zoroark usually starts the battle. But I guess because I was, uh, I predicted that. Uh, it was so obvious. I don't know. He didn't start with it. But, oh, I live on one! I lo I got the accuracy drop, so there's no way in hell that Focus Blast is hitting. But, I live on one! Ah! But, yeah, it doesn't matter in the end because Focus Blast didn't hit. Um... I was thinking if he switched out into someone who, um, like Cradley, then I could get a Focus Blast off, but no. He has the Focus Sash anyways, so really it wouldn't, I guess, uh, I wouldn't have, Fly, I'm gonna have had to take this unnecessary damage. That is a lot of unnecessary damage, actually, but, um, <laughs> so, um, Fly was able to take out this aura. He sends out his Cradley here. So, um, I go for the Dragon Claw again because I am first ended. I can't just switch around to uh, new superpower if I want to. He goes to the Ancient Power. Not sure why. Might just be trying to get his, um, boosts. But, uh, I almost kill it with the Dragon Claw. And he gets the Giga Drain off. I think he should have gone with the Giga Drain first. Um, that way he would have gotten a lot more HP back and then... I don't know. Would have done more damage in the end, probably. Uh, so I switch into Excalibur here. Um, so I could go for the Shadow Sneak, of course. But he predicts that. Goes to the, uh, into Gallade. But that was a mistake because Shadow Sneak is, um, is, is super effective. Uh, but it is the... He played... He did the whole Zangus Needle King Arcanine with, that I did with LG Legendary. So that was a mistake, and then um, Shadow Sneak is able to kill this Cradley without a doubt. So, um, GG Eon, oh well, no, it doesn't kill yet, doesn't kill yet, I was mistaken, doesn't kill yet, he has a chance, he has like 5 HP on that Cradley, he has a chance, calm down guys, he's definitely gonna come back. I didn't just spoil the rest of this battle for you, no, I'm just kidding, he, I go with the slip on you. GG Eon, um, he did ask me for some tips um, on his battle. Um, I guess what I would say is, um, I mean, like, uh, a lot of things that you did were really, really good. Uh, I just got a text message. We're going to ignore that. Um, 
a lot like the sets that you had on your Pokemon I weren't expecting at all um, some of the things uh, like the Murkrow I guess um, like, yeah, I don't know um, I guess you could have uh, switched uh, a little more um, save Pokemon when you could I didn't have anything that could set up hazards except for toxic spikes but uh, clearly that wasn't happening um, so I guess you could have saved your Pokemon uh, definitely watch where you're clicking because those misclicks uh, definitely definitely cost you. Um, those times where I was confused about your moves, I guess um, I don't know. I didn't understand them, but your thought process behind them. But um, yeah, uh, and then also the Mega Barrel, the me the Mega Beeves. Um, not sure why you uh, boosted your special defense when I'm a physical attacker. Um, maybe you predicted I would switch or predicted something else. Maybe you maybe you thought you would live, um, but yeah, there were there was just a few things that I thought were weird. But in the end, I think your actual like your thought processes would probably make sense in your head. Um, but yeah, thank you um, so much for watching. And if you have any tips for Eon or me, what we could have done better or um, what we did wrong, leave them in the comment section below. And then uh, I'm sure I'm sure we will take those tips to heart and become metal battlers. So thank you so much for watching. And until next time, Penguin Nation. Out.